Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm Sab. If you're new here, welcome to the Sab fam. Today we're going to be doing another Zaffle haul. So I've ordered a couple of summer bits from Zaffle. I am working with them again on this video. I've worked with Zaffle a number of times before. If you haven't seen my other videos from Zaffle, I will link of those guys all down below for you. You guys know I'm always 100% transparent about what I think whenever I do my videos. Doesn't matter if something is gifted to me or not. So in this video, there are some hits and there are some misses. I think that Zaffle is one of the brands that I get asked the most questions about when I order from there. People ask me a lot about the sizing, about the quality, and I do agree that some of the things can be hit and miss you kind of have to do trial and error and you have to get to know what things are good to order and maybe a couple of things that aren't necessarily as good so with that being said there's some things in this video that i absolutely love and i've already like literally worn the ish out of and there are also a couple of items that i wasn't happy with so let's just get straight on into it if you need hello I'll leave all the prices of the items on the screen, so we have to bear in mind that everything here is really affordable. I will also link all of the items down below, as well as the sizing on all of the deets. Let's get straight on into it. I'm going to start with my favorite item, because why not? I've had tons of people already ask me where this is from. I think that it's only available in a couple of sizes now. Um, it might even be sold out already. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'll try and link some similar ones down below. Um, but it is basically this oversized t-shirt. If you don't know about me, get to know about me. I live in oversized tees. Like, it's 50% of my wardrobe. Honestly, at this point, I might as well just be like buried in a t-shirt, live in a t-shirt. Like, can I even go back to normal work? because I live in oversized tees now. This is my new fave oversized tee. I wear this so, so much. I just really love the like fluorescent graphic for summer. It's just a really cool like retro style, like boyish print. It's just my vibe, it's just a bit of me. And the fit, the fit of this is everything and more. The sleeves are nice and oversized, it's just big and baggy and she awesome, okay? I really like this. I kind of just pair it up with some cycling shorts or some joggers depending on what mood I'm in and that's it. That's a look. I can't actually remember what size I got this in. Hello? Hello? So this is a size small. So this is massively oversized and I have lots of oversized tees, really cool ones. Um, I definitely want to order some more because I live in them like all the time. So very, very happy with this item and would def recommend this. I've got a couple of bacines, bacines here. I'm gonna leave those till the end. Let's move on to something that I've already worn as well, which I did really like. This I also got in a size small and it's a little pink co-ord. This is the top little pink cute like bralette style top with tortoiseshell buttons it's got this like rougey stretchy material at the back and adjustable straps which is what i need in my life when i'm looking at a product that i want to buy online i will look at reviews i'll look at photos that people have uploaded if it isn't like new in without any reviews um, and I'll look at little details like that, like are the straps adjustable? Because it means then I can like fit it to my size. I really like this, it's really cute. It is really small, so if you don't feel comfortable having your midriff out, you're either gonna need like a super high waisted bottoms, or this is not for you. And it's got a matching shorts, which look like so. Just a little like plain, what do you call this guy? Elasticated waistband. I wear these high waisted and then it comes with this little belt. It's literally just a white like rope belt. This is also in a small. This is really cute on. I like the way that it looks. I would probably switch the belt out for one of my own depending on what shoes I was wearing. Is that weird? Um, I might switch it out for like a different color or better belt. I mean this one isn't anything but it's kind of cute. It's a bit different um, but I like the fact that it's versatile so you can obviously 
like I could wear these shorts without that top like I could just wear like a plain white tee and like tuck it in I think it's quite cute and perfect for this like exceptionally hot and lovely weather that we've been having I come alive in the summertime let me tell you alive the only problem is I just want to lay outside, drink Prosecco and tan. He <laughs> and not do anything else. What else she got? Okay, let's move on to something which is okay. Um, it's not like I'm not obsessed, but I'm not mad. I judge things based on what I expect to receive when I order and what it looks like it is on the website. So this is just a little bandeau. It's ribbed and it's got these little like frills on the top and the bottom. This was a little bit thinner than I was expecting it to be. It's like uber stretchy and the material is quite thin. Are we gonna, are we gonna focus? There we go. I was hoping to get something a little bit thicker and like just a little bit more taut. With this material, um, although it's really comfortable, it's not quite as tight as I would want it to be and is she a little bit see-through? So I think if I put a strapless bra with this, it will sit a little bit tighter and won't be as see-through i don't love strapless bras i just tend to avoid them because i wear them for about 10 minutes and then i want to tear my eyes out because i find them so uncomfortable so for me this is more likely the type of thing that i would pair up with um like over a bikini with some like little like cute trousers like if i've been tanning or something i chuck this on when i want to come inside and like i'm envisioning myself coming back in to make food because i'll only leave the sun when i'm hungry <laughs> and this could get paired with another one of my fave items. So this is a really cute pair of trousers. And I did um and ah between ordering these just for like a hot second. Because they're just a bit different. And I was thinking, is it going to be one of those things that I order and then I don't actually wear? But she's actually really cute. I really like them. And what is happening? Que pasa? What's happening, my friend? They're inside out. It is this pair of like odd polka dot trousers they're in a size small as well and they go down 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 they are flip hello they're flowy into this like ball bottom leg they are pretty tight at the waist uh, but they are small so they've got this like elasticated band you can see it's not like it stretches snaps you in and then it's got this like really adorable little tie you guys will be able to see a little bit better in the trial clip so i thought this being high-waisted can pair perfectly with this they're both nice and loose and flowy for summer and then i got another item which i really love which can also get paired with this it's kind of like cute because it tones down no not that these aren't like casual but it's a very like at leisure like kind of look so basically, this is a sports bra crop top thing. This is how it looks. I love this so much. I'm obsessed with the color. This is like one of my ultimate look colors. I just love it. It's such a nice brown. I also got this in a size small and it's got adjustable straps, so it's perfect. It's got padding inside that I think you can remove if you don't want. This is so cute. I love it. I can just see myself wearing this when i do yoga i can also pair this underneath like a denim jacket compare it up with like a pair of trousers like this i feel like it's very versatile i know it's such a basic item but sometimes the most basic things are the things that i wear the most okay the sun's just come out to play hello sun we're gonna move now on to something that i was not happy with i was actually very disappointed in these and the main reason is because i've ordered activewear from zapple before i've got some really cute pink tie-dye kind of uh, leggings that I always get asked like where they're from whenever I wear them so I ordered another pair thinking they're gonna be like just as good quality but they were not which is sad because they look like they would be so it is a black pair of plain leggings it's kind of got this like little like lines detail I don't really know what to call it this isn't a thing it was a schmishmel Irishmal. Small slash medium. My other ones are a small. Small, medium. I was thinking, okay, it's a good size. They are a good size. They fit on well. Except that the first time I put them on, my ass ripped through. I don't know if this was like a seam that was supposed to be there and I just carried on with the seam. But this, as you can see there, has now become see-through. Which leads me to the conclusion that if you were to do like a couple of squats... These wouldn't last very long. So, unsatisfied customer. 
about these and just because some of their activewear is so good that's what I mean about hit and miss. Like I've ordered some really good activewear pieces. So this one is obviously just a little let down. Okay, I've got one accessory and um, three swimwear bits. Let's move on to the accessory. So I got some sunglasses in this little case, hard shell case, which is quite handy. I actually popped a poll on my Instagram stories when I first got these because they came out so massive, asking you guys if you thought that they were a hit or miss. Majority of people said yes, but they were about, I think it was about 60, 40. These are a bit controversial because they are massive. Boom. Shoots. These are like, in the, in the, I can't even today. Can I even, am I even here in the room? On my poll, I was like, asking if we want to go with the Kris Jenner vibes or not and these are giving me those vibes just for like a hell of a lot cheaper but this is what they look like I think I would still wear them but probably not if I was like out if I was just casually out with like some friends for like a brunch I don't think I would whip out these unless I was really hungover because these will shield your eyes from like everyone and their and their son he <laughs> Pop them on. Oh, they're kind of square shaped. I mean, at the top, like they're a bit hectic. I joke that they're kind of like VR glasses. But you know what? I still wear them, and they these are hard of a cheap. So, who really cares about that? Add you to my sunglass collection. I recently detoxed my sunglasses, um, aka put a lot of them in the giveaway in my charity bins. Um, because I'm a hoarder of sunglasses. Leave a comment down below if you're a hoarder of sunglasses and like when you have a pair that's like still fine and you would still wear them, you just keep them anyway. Like when they're from Primark on their two pounds, girl, if they got scratches on the front, you should probably just give them away. Okay, we move on to swimwear. I've got three swimwear items here. This wasn't the best. Zaffle, I've ordered so many swimwear pieces from me before and they've all been so good. Two of them I dislike, one of them I like, and it's the same reasoning for disliking the bikinis. Let's just get on into it, but basically what I've discovered with Zaffel is that there's a certain style of bikini that they don't do well, and that is the bikini cups. They just get the sizing wrong when it, they have like the wiring. So the first bikini, and it's so sad that this isn't nice, is this pink soft kind of like material baby pink um, bikini it's got these little cups in the front and then it just does up with a little clasp at the back the straps are adjustable which is really nice it's just that the cups are a bit awkwardly fitted and if you look there you can see that the cups are really close together no one's boobs are like that naturally they're just not that close together. They're just a little bit further apart, girl. <laughs> you just needed to have given me a little bit of room in between this cup and that cup. So it's just slightly awkwardly shaped on me. It's not terrible, but it's not good. I don't feel like the bomb.com when I wear these. Those are in a size small, by the way. But then the bottoms are perfect. And I like the bottoms, um, so they fit well. Size small they've got like a cheeky little bum i really like these for the price that you pay for the bikinis like they are generally really good so i like the bottoms then i've got a little purple number i try to go with bikinis that i don't have any of that color already because i do have a fairly large embarrassingly large swimwear collection <laughs> so i try to get ones that i don't have I try to branch out. Now I know I'm not going to branch out anymore. I'm going to go with what I know and what I love. So again, I went for another one of these style cups. Now, this. You can even look at it and see the shape is so interestingly like flat. And again, so close together. And I can't put it on here, but awkward. Like, it's very um, at the bottom like rectangle and then the straps go up and they're like really skinny and it just doesn't really make that much sense it's not terrible it's just not it's just ill-fitting i love the top little strappy things but they could have been attached further in these sit really 
awkwardly on the shoulder. They probably should have been a little bit further into the cup. So that was sad. This is also in that like, cute little rib material. But then again, I love the bottoms. So the bottoms are in the same material, also in a size small, but they've got this adorable little frill, which I really, really like. And they're nice and stretchy. These fit so nicely. So both of the bottoms are a win. And then I've got one bikini, which I like. So this is also, I think it actually, I got this one in a medium, if I'm not mistaken, because I looked at some reviews online and it looked like she came up slightly smaller. So this is a medium, which they've called a UK 10. But like, look at how small the cups are. So when in doubt, look at the reviews. This is a bikini. How super cute is the front? It's got like a double tie detail on the sides. I love the fact that it was white with like the brown leopard print against it. I just thought this was really nice and that it would look fresh on a crisp tan. I'm quite tan at the moment. This is a natural tan because I've been laying out in the sun as I keep hopping on about. And then these are the bottoms. And also when I order bottoms and I'm, well, when I order the set, because these came as a set, and I'm contemplating what size to order. Sometimes if I think I might go for an M, medium, the fact that it has ties will impact that decision because it means I can adjust the sizing and how it fits. So these are the bottoms. They're a really good fit. They tie up nicely. They're kind of cheeky at the back. I just really, really like these. And I love bikinis that are versatile. So I know that I can slap this on with like a black bikini top or with a little white bikini top so I can mix and match my bikinis, which I love so much. So that was everything that I got from Zaffo. Let me know in the comments what you guys thought of the items. Hopefully you guys will see another Zaffo haul from me again soon. I can never stay away for too long. But until next time, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye!